Love is not about the big things. Love is not about big ticket items. Love in itself is purely about simple things that we sometimes overlook. Morning gorgeous, alright so uh, about an hour left of uh, freedom for both of us, um, looking forward to seeing you walk down the carpet and um, yeah, it's the start of the rest of our lives. I keep on giving you cheeks saying you know, you get a shorter prison term for, uh, for murder but I'm happy with this prison term. So, we're gonna get old, let's see what life brings us. All right, love you. A first love comes and goes, but the man I choose to spend the rest of my life with is someone I will lovingly have and hold for as long as we both shall be. I want to be your last, not your first. Marriage is not a condition of relationship. Marriage is a matter of the heart. And so this afternoon we are witnessing both Dale and Elamina surrendering their love for each other. Their love to care for each other. Their love to cherish each other. Their love to lay down their lives and their personal interest in the interest of the other for the well-being, happiness, success, and prosperity. As we now come before God once again, Almighty, and before the independent state of Papua New Guinea, before your friends and your family, that you are now gathered here to exchange your vows, that you will love each other, that you will share every moment, that you will take marriage as an adventure but not as a challenge. Today you're making that vow and that promise that through thick or through thin time not good not good plot time or when you even you're feeling down so low you have low self-esteem regardless of whatever the circumstances may be you are making a promise to stand by each other to my gorgeous wife and our extended family 
I pledge to be a loving and caring husband, father, and also to be a pillar of support for our family. I promise to listen to your hopes and dreams and those of our children to guide and nurture our relationship as well as our children. With an open heart, we'll create a bond and love that only a soulmate can possess. Together, we'll navigate life's joys and challenges, knowing that we are stronger as one and together as a family. I promise to walk by your side forever, to love and encourage you in all that you do. Through all the changes of our lives, I will be there for you always as strength in need, a comfort in sorrow, a counsellor in difficulty, and a companion in joy. Everything I am and everything I have is yours now and forevermore. This is my promise to you. I give you this ring, wear it with love and joy, as this ring has no end, neither shall my love for you. I choose you to be my husband this day and forevermore. As you have both consented in this matrimony, by the powers vested in me by the independent state of Papua New Guinea, I now declare you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. Coming up to us, we were at the bar serving drinks. And he asked, Do you ladies go out? And Element was standing bench, kicking me. No, don't say anything. <laughs> oh, so I prepared this speech like two o'clock this morning. So here it goes. To Mom and Papa Beth. Thank you for all that you've done, not only for me, but to family and friends around us. Looking back 10 years ago, when Papa Bear walked into our lives, I've seen a change in the way my mom smiled. And I'm blessed and honored to have you as a father figure. And I thank God for blessing mom and I, not forgetting John, Serafina, and Jelta, with a loving and caring father like you. Thank you for showering us all with your love. May the good Lord bless you both for the rest of your lives and continue to show you with his love and light upon you both. Thank you. The first time I met her, Dad introduced me and it was essentially the shortest conversation I've ever had with him. He said, this is Ellie, and then Ellie spent the whole afternoon speaking to me instead of him. And now I'm here in PNG for my first time, and I feel very welcome. To Dale and Elamin, wishing your marriage with many blessings and happiness. I would like to say, Ellie, when he met you, because we talk, voice talk, yes, you make him very, very happy. You are the woman that he has been lo looking for all that time. <laughs>